this very episode again i hope you watched the previous uh, video that i that i just uploaded if you did not please make sure you go back and watch it before you come back to this one because this is a continuation of something that started from the previous video guys it is my birthday and guess what i am baking my cake and i'm not baking with an oven i'm going to do it with my tsigiri here as you can see and i'm going to use soy so guys i want to show you the local traditional way how we do the cake guys so please if you did not watch the first part go back and do the watching so i'm going to set my tsigiri already so i can show you how i do it already Remember, we left our door rising. I know you're probably wondering, but how is she going to maintain that heat? Just wait and watch. <laughs> gathered it from the ground like like this very one here you see and then i collected it into my pan guys so this is going to be my oven actually what i'm going to do is to put it on the fire and leave it to first heat up i'm going to leave the sun to heat to a temperature that is uniform throughout the sun then we are going to see what next yeah so guys oh, are you ready to see what the end will be like just watch it to the end this is the blue band that i left and i left it for a purpose it's not just it wasn't just a mistake i'm going to use this to smear it beneath the pan this is to avoid that you know there is that kind of burning that happens so this is to avoid that i'm going to smear this beneath the pan i'm going to use both those pans We put just a light layer of this to help seal with the burning. You know, controlling heat on the cigar is not very easy. And as you notice, I did a layer of, uh, I poured some sand into that pan, yeah? The reason is to avoid the direct heat from the fire. So that is more regulation of heat as well. actually ready to be put on the fire like you saw earlier on i put here sand 
and it is already hot i can feel it it has heated up so that is i told you for heat control and what i'm going to do is to just place this here like this and leave it there and then cover this of course like this so i'll check this in about um 40 minutes guys so let's give it 40 minutes and come back and check guys guess what i had to wait until it night falls but the waiting was not in vain just come and have a look we just got ourselves a cake and there we are yes it flopped but you know the regulating heat in this uh, kind of pan is not very easy and that's the reason it flopped but the cake is superb because i checked and this is how i check it with just my knife so it's deep inside if it comes out clean like this smooth you notice no sticking that means the cake is ready and guess what our cake is super soft guys so whoa, we made it so let's put this off but remember we had two pans of cake so we're going to put this one off so we're going to give it time to cool overnight so we can do the icing it's extremely hot so here we are with our cake and we're putting this one back on fire because we have another cake to bake the second one remember This is the second one we are going to bake as well. So let's just put it in here. Okay, there we go. And I'm just going to cover it again. So let's leave that one to bake. As we take this for cooling, just wait for the icing part, guys. Make sure you don't miss it. It is super, super interesting. Thanks for watching. guys happy birthday to me it is already my birthday as i speak it is 24th of august where i am please let me know what is the date right now where you are guys literally this cake slept over i told you it had to cool right so guys in case it's your first time watching this video make sure you go back and watch the previous video guys this is a continuation of a video that started with part one in the previous upload and guess what i'm doing my birthday cake myself in the village with a cigarette so i bet i literally did this on a cigarette uh, with sand guys make sure that you go back and catch up with that video because you're going to mess up here like you're not connect so guys i'm going to start the icing i'm just right here to icing sugar and i'm going to have some eggs here so let me beat the eggs but like you know i'm only going to need the white like the egg white i won't need the yolk so I'll just prick it a bit Just for the white to pour. So let's add the sugar on it, the icing sugar onto it. Yes, our icing sugar is actually ready there's also this one which is a bit lighter than this this is going to be the first layer and i'm going to add this on top so next i'm going to level the cake because i 
I need it smart. Right, perfect. Let's do the icing now. So guys, after putting this uh, lighter layer, I'm going to give it some one or two minutes just to harden a bit before I can add this thick icing on top of it guys so let's give it a minute one minute is done so let's do the the real icing now guys i just did that first layer and now this is my favorite color as you can see i'm even wearing it <laughs> i'm wearing pink and yeah i love pink so i'm going to add pink food color onto this guys i'm only finishing smoothening the top because on the side i'm going to give it another design so i don't need to bother so much smoothening on the side yeah and that is the reason you're seeing the side looking like that so my favorite color right there and i'm going to give it a i think i'm going to write in white pink and white oh my god it's my birthday <laughs> Are you happy for me you guys are you please let me know in the comment section if you love what i'm doing let me know how you guys do birthday celebrations at home if i just did something at least you know i did i tried my best i mean this is a village hustle it went very easy to do it the local way the way i did but please let me know what you think about my cake in the comment section so i'm going to give it some minutes again to to dry a bit because I want to design the, the, the side, yeah, and then also give my writing on top. So let me give it some minutes and then we come back. And I'm going to use this now for writing, and I'm going to use this packet here for the icing sugar. there we go happy birthday uni so oh. <laughs> 
interesting. Now what I'm going to do is to work about the sides. Perfect. So let's give it some little more <laughs> design. Doesn't it look colorful, guys? Just have a look. Happy birthday, Eunice. Is it clear enough? Please let me know. They love my cake, you guys. Just let me. Please talk to me in the comment section already. What I've been waiting for, guys. I am super, super, super happy. Ah, oh, wait for the next video, guys. We are going to cut this cake and ensure that you don't miss that video because it is going to be a big celebration in our home today guys thanks a lot for staying here with me thanks a lot for watching please let me know what you think about my cake in the comment section let me know if i did anything or i missed anything also in the comment section or correct me i mean what can i say i'm too happy already it's my birthday you know happy birthday to me <laughs> thanks for watching wait for the next video because that's going to be where we're going to be cutting it